Hey guys, this is Reginald from Bay Street. I'm wondering if you can recognize this space. Um, just give you a closer look before I tell you a little bit more. So you can see uh, this is um, actually the newer space from NS Design. And um, you know at Bay Street we are just so crazy about bases and so we want to be the first to tell you about um, the latest that's happening in the Bay scene and of course you can get it right here um, at Bay Street. So this is um, the NS Design Ray um, Radius 5 um, just launched um, this year at the NAMM show in January and, and, and NS Design has just started shipping this so we are one of the first to uh, receive this space and um, and I've just been spending some time setting it up and trying it and it sounds uh, absolutely amazing. Um, so this is a five string bass. You can see it's a headless which um, is what NS uh, Design have been known for. Um, you know Ned Steinberger started making the XLs uh, back in the 80s. Um, they had a full one piece graphite body and then they had the budget um, Spirit series. Uh, subsequently, they had the Synapse and um, now the Radius and um, you know this I think is one of the best that they have ever made. Um, so this bass uh, doesn't need the double ball strings um, but you can use um, you know your regular strings. Um, what else? Uh, it's on this bass. Um, it's actually a soft maple body, so you can hear that there's uh, quite a bit of attack on this base. Uh, it's actually a maple neck, but there's a graphite reinforcement inside, phenolic fingerboard, so that you get a balanced tone, but you have absolutely no dead spots. 24 frets, 35 inch scale for that tight and clear B string. Um, these are EMG soap bars, very unique soap bars because it's actually curved. Um, so you know one thing about NS design bases is about ergonomics. And so having this curved pickup that follows the radius of um, the fingerboard, it makes it extremely easy to play. Um, the weight is very nice and balanced, not too heavy. And um, you have volume, pickup blend, bass treble, there's a switch to switch between your front and back um, magnetic pickups. The blend actually blends between your piezo and your magnetic and of course there is um, like an EQ switch for your piezo depending on how much treble you want to boost. So one thing that um, NS has done for this bass is actually redesigning the whole piezo pickup. Um, because you know the piezo of the past, uh, they can sound very brittle, very harsh. Um, but this one actually retains that full body acoustic tone um, and so I think NS has done an excellent job just redoing uh, and redesigning uh, piezo pickups. So this has actually an adenized aluminium bridge and uh, this uh, NS design uh, bridge as well um, that never goes out of tune so you know, you can go to a gig, you don't even have to tune, just plug and play and you're good to go. One thing about this bass, you can see, it's curved. So, um, I think NS calls this a diradial design. So, it's supposed to fit to your body contour. So, everything about this bass screams ergonomics. And, um, well, enough said. Uh, let's hear how it sounds. So, what I want to... Uh, do first is just to show you the tone from the magnetic pickup. So you can hear that it sounds nice and round. B string. So it's really full um, and right now it's just magnetic so if I boost the EQ a little bit, give it some bass and treble, straight away you can hear that the tone is more full.
So this is the magnetic pickup and then let's see how the slap tone sounds like. Great sustain. So if I flip this switch, it actually goes to the bridge pickup. So straight away you get that Jaco sound. You know, and if it's too bright, just roll off the treble a bit. So this is using the bridge pickup. Great harmonics and if I flip over the switch it goes to the next pickup. the treble a bit wow I just love the sound of the neck pickup is um it has that old school p bass vibe um, which uh, is very nice so um, that's the magnetic portion and so if I turn this knob all the way to the bridge side I'm actually using the piezo now so you can hear that the piezo okay let me just crank up the EQ back to center so you can hear now the tone is more acoustic and if I flip the switch to the middle position, more treble now, and even more, you know, it's very zingy now, basically it gives you a lot of tonal possibilities, but you know, the special thing about this is that it has a very full body, even though this had a brighter setting, but you know, you don't feel that it is losing out on um, that, that 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 full acoustic sound so let's say if I put it at the treble cut position it gives me that sound of the nice acoustic bass And if it's still too bright, you can actually roll off the treble. Maybe let's say if I boost the bass a bit. Actually, has a bit of that double bass feel. Um, so I'm still at the piezo pickup end. You know, it's just so versatile. So if I blend the piezo and the magnetic together, that's how it sounds. Let's hear it. So you now you have the combination of the magnetic. 
but you have a bit of that zing from the piezo. So I want to give it a bit of bass. Sounds great. Extremely versatile. The last thing I wanted to tell you about the bass is actually the case. So it comes with a NS Design case and you can see that the case is pretty small. Probably about the size of um, a guitar and very compact and portable. So you know if you're looking for something that's easy to bring around, maybe even for ladies, you don't want something that's too massive, uh, this would actually be a good bass uh, to consider. Um, finish is uh, nitro cellulose, so it's very nice, smooth satin. It has a translucent black finish, flame maple top. Um, this is also available with amber uh, amber finish. Um, you can also get it as a fretless. Also, if you like to custom it further, this is actually the CR series, which is made in Czech Republic. Uh, there's also a custom series, um, custom shop series uh, made in the US and you can have that with tons of options, uh, different woods for the neck, for fingerboard, you can have it with maple, um, you can have different woods, different tops. So lots of opportunities, lots of possibilities um, to create your dream NS design headless uh, radius 5 base. So, this uh, video has been a bit long, but there's so much features about this space that I wanted to tell you about, and I hope that you enjoyed watching this. So thanks again for your time, and uh, do contact us if there's uh, anything that we can help you with to find your ultimate base. So remember, Base Freak, your only cure for gas. Thanks for watching. Bye. Peace. So this uh, video has been a bit long, but... There's so much features about this space that I wanted to tell you about and I hope that you enjoyed watching this. So thanks again for your time and uh, do contact us if there's uh, anything that we can help you with to find your ultimate base. So remember Base Freak, your only cure for gas. Thanks for watching. Bye.